Smokes are going down. They're going for that quick plant if possible. And they've gained a lot of ground here. Okay, holding it. Now they've got some nades for Kenny, and two of them aren't enough. Oh, but the bullets are. Bomb went down regardless, though. So perhaps advantage G2, despite the man disadvantage. Yeah, the bomb will count as an extra man at this point, but it's a retake setup for Astralis. You can see them dropping smokes towards Shaw here. Kind of nullifies Amanek. He's given up his position as well, taking some pop shots towards the boost position. We have got the Astralis boys now encroaching towards the bomb, but the defuse not going to be fully committed oh. to, and we have got Zipex fending them off here. It's going to be a team kill oh, coming no. through. It's absolute pandemonium. Two versus two, there's surely no time. Uh, it's absolute chaos. And we all see Jackson Amanek closing things out. Three for Jackson in the end, one of them is teammate, but one more smoke deployed. Nexa there, which is no help at all. Kenny S, the walking wounded as well. They'll go for the plan. The swing will come through. The grenade, oh. not quite enough. And it takes Amanek down to nine. <laughs> Astralis in such a fantastic position. They need to find these kills quickly. Look at the health, Henry. 17, two, nine. Kenny does manage to claw one back with his low HP. Nexa not the same for him. And now, gonna have to play the game of survival. Might wanna get that rifle on Hunter. Otherwise, this is gonna be very difficult. Fake from Glaive, Amanek. Just baiting in the smoke. It fades now. He loses his guys and will eventually get caught. Dupree's push doesn't find too much. They He's have to, to hold it. He's going to Hope for the best. It might still work out for them. One more kill will do it. They're not defusing. And oh, it's going to work. It's Astralis who will be finding that defuse in the end. They had to go for a chat and there was 10 seconds on the nose when they started defusing. Containing that ramp aggression, it seems oh though. My what, God, what just happened to their health? Hunter with a fantastic two piece though. Does claw G2 back in firm control of the round. Amanek forced off of the flames. Nexo with low HP is actually going. He can get caught here and he oh. does. The bomb will not be planted. A spectacular lineup from Device. Yeah, very confident. And there's an incendiary to deny the plan further. You can see Amanek scrambles to get the bomb down here. They will allow him to do so. And it's Kenny S defending from the sandbags here. Amanek does manage to peel away and the. Rite begins here. It's not looking good for Amanek. He goes down to about one oh. HP, but Kenny S, he pulls things back. It's actually a two versus two now. They still have a Molotov. Smoke and a kit available for Glaive. That'll land on top of the bomb now. Nullifies the Molotov, and the defuse should be happening momentarily. So Device's responsibility makes a lot of sense. The fake, the frag, they are low. Amanek the same. Sound cube. Oh, oh the molly. No. Glaive just backed up into it. That was supposed to be the, the fake. Round. That should be the round right there. There's no time for device. And just like that, Amanex flames have done all the hard work. He doesn't really know what's going on. Can't believe it. Does he die as well? No, he's cool. So device. Have a lot of damage inflicted. It's a good incendiary though. And that just will be caught out. It's going to be a trade from Kenny, so they might have a chance here. They certainly might. It depends on Device, and he's looking pretty crispy. Oh. So was Jax, though. He does manage to shut down the sniper. Hunter, if only he had the bomb, there would be so much space there. But instead, he's on the A site, rotating through. He could get a he flank, but he's being down. very loud about this. And with only 10 seconds, this could be his death. Oh. And one bullet, there it is. He needs to die. Six. Five. If he keeps the oh, rifle. No, no the, oh, it's the, the end. Eagle's it's not the end of the world, I suppose. Yeah, but he would have gotten the lost bonus of yeah. one. Don't think it's gone well at all in terms of the finances. And Glade, hungry for blood. Looking for that second kill here. It's roasting to a crisp. Surely he gets taken out. And there it is. A couple of kills now for G2, but the bomb has been spotted. Down towards scaffolding, and we have got a three on three. Best chance they've had in a while, to be honest with you. Hunter and Exit are removed. It's normally Hunter who's instrumental towards the A side of things. And Jax, key frag, goes in Zipex's favor. Bomb still down. Look at the flank as well. They've contained them. Dupree, he's got them locked in towards A now. He doesn't have to do anything else. He can just sit and wait. Once the threat level reaches red, he can push on through, lock them in, and it should be done and dusted. Calm as you like. Device will knock another down. And the flank from Zipex this time. His presence on short has been very successful. Influential, he's so good on this map, and you don't see him whether due to the financial decisions. Here comes a full commitment, looking much better. Next up, and Jax cracking the A side wide open here. Should be around already. That confirms it. Amanek will take down Dupree. Five versus two, Glaive and Device. Can't even think about this one. But as we mentioned, the money's already built up to such an astronomical level. Device might be able to stay around and do something with this. Oh. And unfortunately for him, has been spotted. Next, uh, takes him down and just up the Glaive to try and do some damage on the exits. Side of things here. So here's the first, and he converts. He's good for two, and he's out of there. So enough damage has been done. Clave's happy enough with this. He's going to die in transition. Amanek will finish him off, but as Henry was just saying, money is good. The bar will come back out, and maybe...
Though. Using that secondary all to oh. actually misses a shot you'd think he'd have at the Ooh. lock and key. Yeah, and now look at them. The bunnies have already made it to B. Pushed up on the Jenny and a missed shot again from Dupree. It's double from Amanek. Hunter's found one as well. The site is there. His device got to find a quick one and say WP. He won't be able to contest the plant. Kenny's supporting as well. A quick one, but not possible. Nice hold. And that's another for G2. Quite the pivot. Dead. There we have it. Well, it's given the option for Zipex to try and bait him in here, but the wall bank started to be attempted. Actually lands as well. Glabe will pull one back. He's to try and drop the smoke here. Surely they'll swing on his position. Mage is trying to protect him the best he can. And there's the bomb. Astralis with three kills open things up here. Can yes pulls one back? It's the wall bank towards Glaive. Bomb still down there, woman in 15. And device. That was a lock in. He could see the barrel, but Amanek, he reads it well. The flank shut down and the round back in contention. 4G2. Push up, passive lines held by now, four now by, oh, Zipex. He was holding it, does oh. get caught, and they're, they're in everything pretty damn cleanly today. And a safe plant from Amanek. He'll be able to get out of dodge. Hunter's behind enemy lines, biding his time in the smoke. Now, as it fades, they're not expecting it. He does catch a flash, but gets away. Three versus three as it's equalized by Glaive. Time for the retake. Danes have smokes, kits, the whole shebang. Well, the MAC-10 up close and personal, in hand by Amanek, and I thought he's going to fall off there. Regardless, he'll be taken down, and Nexa, the in-game leader for G2, left to win out in the one versus three, full flash to the face, but he has got time on his side. This quick kill has to go in his favor. Second nice. one as well. Has he done it up to this point? I think he might have done the full defuse coming it. through, and it's not going to work out for Device. He'll get the kill once again, and G2, they just about claw through it. Device survives. Some of the woes they've had to face have actually got together a pretty decent haul, but the last round will be compromised. Great <laughs> shot from Dupree as they vault up towards construction here. We are going to see Jax open things up. Kenny S in the rear as well with the Galil, but the orb is too quick. That's going to be Device bringing things back to an even keel, but still absolute chaos here. We have had a very entertaining first map, and it is going to be a three on two in favor of G2 as they plant towards B. Yeah, Jax is in quite the optimal position here. I'm not sure Device is going to be ready for this. Oh. Oh, lovely. Pays off, finds the head, and Hunter will find the last. We got an 8 7 half out of that. Here we go. Uh oh, uh oh. When the first shot's not clean, that power loses, oh, or that dead. position loses all its power. They choose to back up. Interestingly enough, Hunter, he will be challenged again from that headshot position, but his existence is wasting time. Now it forces the Molly out, and that's all the nades gone on Glaive. He can get back into the site. Astralis have messed this one up. Yes, potentially with 35 seconds there. Luckily, the headshot hits device, doesn't do a ton of damage here. And still, the bomb will continue its progress towards Ava Hunter. He's done such a great job this round. Still alive and kicking, looking for his fourth kill. Not going to happen, but certainly will for Jax. They find a clean sweep there. Now some space being taken, and it's device that's really found a lot. But Glaive caught wow. out again on their own, and Nexa so precise with that MP9. It's not looking like a disadvantage in their hands this round. No, it's actually looking very good for them. They've got players towards B, device flashed off, and have to buy this time now, and Magis pulls one back here, so they've got a chance to get this plant down and actually have a smoke in reserve as well, but that's now been removed. Device dropped, Kenny S doesn't look like he's gonna miss again, but he does. Two on two, 25 seconds remaining, bomb to be planted here, but it's a fake. Oh, I'm nervous for them. And now Zipex has pushed in perfectly. All onto Nexa then. He will shut down. Magius can they in line. He just holds down Mouse 1, collects 2, and wins a crucial round. Drops the incendiary to uh, give him a bit of space, meaning they can't swing towards with the Tech 9. Challenges T-Spawn, clean kill. Follows it up with the second, and it's Nexa. With the strong form continued here. And so he'll get the third kill of the round. 10 to 8 as G2 look very comfortable here. Just Magius and Zipex remaining. Shouldn't be any conversation about them getting the bomb down here, but maybe they can find a kill or two. This shot might just enable them. Zipex, there it is. Just one. Can't really do much of it. Might not even get to the rifle. Trying to make his way towards construction, but he'll be taken down in a second. That's going to be Hunter as G2. Could get caught from either side. He's got his teammate responsible for one, but now he's gone down. Hunter falls. The spray from Jackson inflicting good damage and spotted. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Glaive jumping for the info, and he gets more than that. A headshot. And now the site can go down, or rather the bomb can go down. It's the flank from Magisk. He holds it, contains it, and now the tenth converted. Well, then they're going to have to work out what they're going to do. They've only got one left, so if they want to burn it now... Can he S or would he want to be? Oh, he's actually come in. All right, then. CZ, if he gets this opening kill, 
Don't be enough for Kenny. There it is. And the bomb, bomb goes down as well. This is huge. And Amanex pushed for another. Oh, and Kenny's orbs filled the feed. He's My goodness. Flash. G2, they've got the advantage. They just need to finish the job. There is a lot of time and a lot of very talented players. A weapon retrieval goes wrong. No, it doesn't. Nexa still gets that frag despite the disadvantage and device. Oh my goodness, very quick oh. from Nexa. He falls as well. G2 with only an AWP. <laughs> Crucial opportunity from Device. They both peak, but Zipex actually catching short player. Hunter now has a lot to do. He is dinked. He's hiding behind the sandbags. A smoke's not going to save him. <laughs> Device is the only one to have fallen for Astralis so far. However, Dupree hasn't cleared his corners. He's going to go down, but at least the information's there. They know where Nexa is. They can isolate and chase if they need. We'll see if they can do so. Don't have the biggest bank rolls to necessarily justify, but we have the one player right next to him. That's Zipex, who I think spotted him through the top hauling. We are going to have a final kill found. Well, he has to deliver more than one. Yeah, and already tested. Kenny will only hit the flick. Device. His bullet more lethal, and Device has got another one. Hunter needs both. He needs that AWP, but he does good damage to Magisk instead. I don't know if that's a valid compromise, because already a four versus two, one of them needed to translate into a kill. And just Amanek and Jax, they do recover the AK-47, though. So not all is lost, but no one there, though. So don't get the quick kill they're looking for. And Astralis ready and waiting for that peek from the crane. There it is. Huge. And he can't really contest, especially when Device is hitting everything. Two riflers go down, and it's the AWPer to open up the A site. At such a crucial juncture of the game. Round 28. Kenny now has to overcome the odds, and he's lost his teammates as well. Amanek and Kenny S. No rush to get this bomb down. He had the good timing on his spray. He understands where they're coming from, just not quite enough to translate into kills. It's going to be compromised here. To defend, to make sure that Astralis don't take their map pick, the buy is not going to be great. But G2, a familiar set of circumstances now could get worse. Nexa, he's exposed, and Dupree's found the perfect oh. off angle. It's looking good for the finish here. That kill might change things slightly. Three players stuck in towards the elevators. They're starting to pull kills back here, but they know where the remaining two are now. Hunter. He'll still have 100 HP, two kills to his name, and Kenny S at 21, but B Control has been gifted towards Estrella. CT seemed to be aware of it. This kill, oh, not the cleanest from Dupree. He has been struggling this game. The grenade might find him. Not quite. Kenny S to try and clutch out. It looks like Astralis could have Vertigo in the bag. They do. 16 to 13, the final score. Will fully commit. They're going towards the bathrooms here, and it's a great shot from Kenny. He'll actually get away with it as well. Just about round the corner. Oh, I don't know if he's going to be anticipating device. This is a lovely off angle. Hello, surprise, and maybe a second. It's Nexa. He's got the kit. He's got the smoke. He's going to deploy that now for a survival oh. attempt, and it's working kind of. But staring at the corner, they can't quite believe their luck. They have space, and they should have that plant. Magic does have the bomb. They've lost Glaive in the process, though. Three versus three. Well, the bomb will be going down, but it is a three on three. And we have got a, what looked to be a guaranteed frag there. Zipex is still alive. It will be made just to go down first. Significant damage inflicted to the other two. And the defuse, well, it's already been attempted. It will be a fake and a close range kill from nice. Zipex here. They haven't committed to the bomb just yet. And Device now, oh, perfect okay. shot. That's lovely. Jax will be absolutely ruined there. Amanek will find a kit, the kit, pull a headshot back as well. He's, he can fall defuses, I would. Yeah. Stick on it. He's holding it. Oh, he's and Zipex is trying to call the bluff. You pros don't fake. Amanek certainly is being paid a salary. Can't dispute with that one. And he is even going to get the kill. Three kills. We can hear Glaive looks away at the worst possible time. But did he get a single kill? Well, his teammate certainly has now in the Ow. form of a dink. Or a bink, depending on where you're from. We are going to see Glaive here. Surely get his oh, first kill. Wow. The Hunter somehow styles him in the FAMAS there. And now they're right back in the round. It's up to Magis to find Kenny S. And one hill convert quite cleanly. Two towards Monster and the flashbangs are superb on both sides. Two on two. Jackson and Amanek have a chance here. Yeah, it's a small one. No smoke, no hope, and out goes Jax. But they do a lot of damage. You said they should, and they do. Taking out an extra three rifles, it will be just Dupree and Magius holding on to theirs. Hunter oh, can lock him in here. Him? I think he might have been spotted. Look how tight of a line Glaive's working with great control. Oh, he's going to get traded. He sniped out. That's the bomb delivered. 
Amanet can do a lot with this. If he has a smoke, he doesn't, but a nade will at least enable him to reposition. What you'll have to, Device is hot on his heels at this stage. That's a guaranteed frag. He takes damage for it, though. That's disappointing. Probably converted by Jax at this stage. He'll be focusing towards long AK out. Not sure Nexa can really stop this plan. He will be checked. Oh, Zipex tagged down low. It's not enough. What? No frags. That Jax, perhaps. It's Device. They weren't planting that, were they? Free. No, not yet. Work on that now. We'll get back to the round four and four. Hunter heads up and look completely flashed off. You can see Dupree peeking at the assist there. Certainly earned it. And there's three stacked in towards B. And this is like by the first time they go A. Could be. Yeah, it kind of hinges on what device reports. And well, with frag like that from Jax, long range into B. Zipex a duel with Jax. And he wins it so cleanly. That's lovely. So advantage Astralis into the site. Please be careful here. Amanek still towards the barrels. Keeping his head down. Oh, Magus doesn't commit to the check. There is, there's the kill. A double. Amanek pulls it off. He might have won the round single handedly there. Perfect we'll bait. It looked great. Unfortunately, though, oh. so does Device Amanek. Crucial. Finds three. Needed two. And in this one, now Kenny. Spots and eliminates Magus. He's handling this well. Does just think better of the incendiary. Outcome in mind there, flashing off the key spots. This is a key jewel though, and it will be Dupree coming out on top there. Jax didn't quite tuck himself in, and Zipex, he could swing around off this. Kenny S removed either way. His job's done for him by device, and that could be enough here. The flank oh. from Hunter. He's pulled off the initial shot here, but that gives up his spot. Do they want to go for this? The money is incredibly They're low. They're going for it. They are going for it, and Zipex knows there's two heading towards bank. Yeah, it should be one. Nice from Nexa. Time is of the essence. You need to get someone on it now. Already Dupree knocks one off the perch. No one's defusing. They're losing all their weapons. Nexa has there's to no hold time. it. No time. It's the fake, and Device will go down with the ship, but three kills and a fifth for Astralis. And their Molotov has worked perfectly so far, and now they continue to push in. And Kenny actually yeah, could get both. Yeah. That's not bad at all. He'll take a rifle, two kills. It looked like he was getting just awkward enough there. I think he gets the third as well. Very awkward oh. for Device, and yeah, they shouldn't be committing to that. Should have just got out. Kenny's done so much, he can do even more. He really could. Fan back in 2014, yeah. you've got cash to splash today. There's about three people, I think, who are recent <laughs> Kenny fans back in 2014. Uh. <laughs> so Zipex then, we, we know he's capable of it. And here we go, we're off. He's going to get his first one. And I dare say he wins at this stage. He's planted for bank, but he's <clears> playing from toilets. There's a smoke on the site on Kenny's body, though. He's they could so pick brave. that up. What if they just hold it now? They are. 10, 9, 8. He's still holding it. So now, you've lost the round. round. You've lost oh, the round. Oh, oh. He's got it, Jax. Oh. Was holding oh. down that diffuse for a 10 seconds. And Zipex, that plant spot comes back to bite him. He Coming to the last few stages of this first half, flash over from G2 does lead the mages to a double, and that could be their commitment towards B. Hunter will have to defend, then nothing he can really do about it, boys. Every chance, it looks like they're coming right back into the round. Alex, uh, you're a pretty curious guy, right? So you want to see what's going on with that smoke? And Magus, he's actually threaded the needle here. I think he might be able to shut both of these kills down. Oh, if he, he gets someone towards water, one. that's a guaranteed kill. Hasn't checked his close corner, and now Jax will be called out. Hello? Did he just drop the he spray did, there? He, just did. To... he did. He is a cheeky boy. I'm trying to work out the mentality there. Where there's, there's, I know JW does that a lot, just before he goes for a kill. Just to maybe get everyone a little bit excited. Device, you'd think he'd hit that one. Instead of 2 on 2, favor Astralis with the bomb down. Even more so now, AK-47. One versus one. No way he's going to outweigh Device, and it will be another round of the ball for the day. Have a bird's eye view of the barrel position. No one there. Fortunately, oh, he does spot two. one. Well, that's some information. He's got util to burn. Device catching Jax. He knows there's another on the site. Next, it will be mollied. Flash. Oh, this feels so brutal. The Danes are so coordinated. How has he not been spotted? So <laughs> blind, it doesn't even matter. That was like a five second flash. Yeah, he couldn't have been more flashed if he tried, I think. And the H will be thrown in. It does do significant damage, but uh, they can't save. Where well, they off to towards heaven, I believe. That's where the orb, a nice wall bang comes in from Amanek. Gives him a chance here with May Disc and Device so low, but the missed orb shot probably going to cost him the round here. Amanek desperately trying to make this one work, but there it is. Astralis and their map pick. They will be posting double digits.
Running out of options now. Yeah, they certainly are. They're going to have to convert Ooh. this second pistol again. They're going to stand a chance, but it doesn't look good. The first two kills going in favor of Astralis, but not for long. A bit of life here from G2 now. Amanek left with Kenny S in the three versus two, but the bomb is down. Good smoke. Might change that fact. Zipex will try and dissuade them and push them back here, but Kenny S has no problem getting that bomb and retreating. They could even go towards A. He's trying. He wants to. Zipex is so aware and he's done the damage. One final frag onto Amanek required. Device is the one to secure it and that's a real warning sign. 20. And before that, there was only a handful in 2019. So, so for example, your pop flashes won't be as tight. Your smokes will take a second to line up. You won't feel comfortable in a lot of mid-round or clutch situations because you haven't been in them before. But if the kills come your way, you can definitely convert them here. So they've steadied. It's a 3v3. Into the toilet. He could get caught out. Shadow doesn't even pull the trigger. Kenny's coming from long. This is looking fantastic for G2. They had a disadvantage at one point. Glaive's charging up long to contribute. Rotate coming in from Dupree as well. They've only got a single flashbang. Spots Kenny. That's the duel he was hoping for. Now makes it a 2v2 as the bomb is planted. Still G2 favored here. Glaive's the only one with the kit, so he's currently further away from the bomb site. This is going to be tough to get back into. Oh. oh, that was the moment there. A real chance, but it looks like G2 might have done enough. Glaive, he'll be towards the bathroom. He bows out of the round trouble here. Let's see if the flash from Kenny's any better the second time around. We'll do pre-play the anti-flash. No. Oh, 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 okay. So the flash from Kenny does work at this time and Device has caught another. To be fair, it still flashed his teammate there. He saw the assist come through, so they still haven't quite nailed it. Um, but it's still, the flash was spot on in terms of catching Dupree. Oh, but they're no. going to have to do a bit more than that to take him down. It's looking very good. Bear in mind the lost bonus. So they don't get a bomb down here. $1,900 per player and they'll be 13-6 down. Could Bombs down in playground. Oh, that's a problem too. Yeah, that's a massive problem. Oh, um, that's no. That's going to add insult to injury. What a shot from Zupree. It's getting worse out there. Hunter, we've seen him do some crazy things with the AK before, but he has nothing to say this time round. That's 13 on the board for Astralis. A lot of overaggression here from Astralis. That's what I'm talking about with flexing right now, pushing around, understanding that they can take the fight to G2. They don't have to sit and play the fundamental counter-strike. Yeah, and oh goodness. Hello. Me. Jack, you gotta know how to do that, John, my friend. Give it up. There it is, he's finally up. <laughs> Don't show sure why he went for on the third time. I'll, I'll really be honest with you there. After he failed it twice, probably let it go. But uh, although he's quite deep, it is gonna be a bomb down. Yeah, on towards Optimus, and nothing they can do to stop it. So that's step one. Unfortunately, they've lost Nexa, and Hunter in a prime position, but Betrayed. he's only gonna have. Himself to rely upon. Device on for an ace already. Four kills. Oh, he's already aware of it, or at least looking at it. He knows it's a possibility. He's going to check it with the Deagle, the ace from Device <laughs> for round 15. Well, the flash missed. The flash oh, missed. Oh, and Zipex has got vision. He doesn't get a frag, though. And neither will Magisk. He's got two in before he goes down. Dupree adds a third to the list. And that bomb needs to go down. Kenny's responsibility. Dupree in that heaven position. He's kind of locked in. Flank on towards Dupree. This frag is everything. Oh. He can't hit it. Kenny can. And now all on to Dupree. He's got two to find. Doesn't look very positive, especially oh, with Hunter's dead. flank. And now a stylish finish. He'll be able to tap away at the back of the head. We oh, Amaneki spotted at least one. I guess at least traded, one. But Dupree, a big test for him. And Jax wasn't ready for it. That's the bomb delivered. His double kill could be a round winner. He's anticipating more and he's going to get caught with nades in his hands. Kenny burns down to 14 and the frag from Device almost secures the round. There's no time for Hunter to retrieve that bomb and plant. That's it. It's all done, I think. And it's going to be the 2-0 for Astralis. That kill confirms it. Device with a show-stopping performance.